I thought I did, except I just moved it. All right. All right. Welcome to Hope Baptist Chapel, everybody. We're glad you're here. If you can't hear me, say so. I'll speak up. I hear you. I hear you. All right. Good. Sorry. Ignore the dog. It's the cat next door. Let's say our vision verse together, which is on the piece of paper that starts, when God steps in, miracles happen. Right? So everyone see our vision verse, 2 Corinthians 3.17? Are you ready? I'm ready. Ready. All right. Now, the Lord is the Spirit, and where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. And what we want to do is say the Pledge of Allegiance as a prophetic word over America that we are indivisible with liberty and justice for all. We want that to be a true statement. So let's pledge allegiance to the flag. Um, we don't really have one, but out of respect, if you want to stand, fine, but we don't have a flag. So, ready? Mm -hmm. All right, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Save all. All right, and according to 1 Timothy 2.2, 2, um, we are commanded by God to pray for kings and for all that are in authority, that we may lead a quiet and peaceable life in all godliness and honesty. And because of that, we pray for the president. And right now, the president is Trump. So, I will pray for the president. Father, I do pray for the president. I ask that you would bless him, that you would surround him with godly counselors that you would protect him and his family, that you would keep them safe, help him to lead the country in the way that you would wish him to do, I pray in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Um, and we also want to pray that China's involvement in our election be exposed. That's been in the news a lot. And so um, we want there to be a clear legal winner for the presidency, um, Chuck Pierce, who is a prophet that David and I follow out of Texas, um, gave a prophetic word that says we won't know who the president is until January the 18th. <coughs> but we want to pray that all legal cases, right now there's a lot of lawsuits going on, we want to pray that all legal cases be heard and ruled correctly. We know that God is in charge and we want his ways to be fulfilled. So let's pray for that. Father, I pray right now that China's involvement in our election process be exposed and Jesus. that a clear legal winner for the presidency be declared. I ask that all legal votes be counted, that all legal cases and um, irregularities be heard and ruled correctly. I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Now, we're going to have...